Hello, my name is Tudor Lopushan and now I'm going to show you another easy way to install Spark and try and to have the possibility to try some examples of Sparks. For this, all you need is to install Docker. For this, you have here uh, the Docker documentation on how to install it. You can see that you can install Docker on a lot of operating systems like on Linux. You can install on cloud or you can install or on Mac, or Mac OS machine or a Windows machine. For example, I tried this example. So here you have all the necessary information on how to, how to install Docker. After you have the Docker installed, you need to create a Docker Hub account. Here I have my account. Let us in, log into it. And from this Docker Hub, we need to download uh, a container that already contains all the dependencies for uh, for running Spark. So now we are in uh, my Docker Hub account, and here we have the possibility to search for a lot of containers. But now we only need uh, uh, a container that contains Zeppelin on it installed. So you can see that it fo it found a lot of containers, but let's let's try this one. Here we 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 see a lot of uh, you see a, a short description. We see the purpose of the of the of this container. For example, this container runs the Zeppelin container in Spark local mode or in a Spark cluster. We are gonna try the Spark local mode. And information how to download it and how to how to install it. All you need is is uh, is, the, is is to execute uh, these two lines. But for first, you need to to run our um, Docker. Here they are. So let's see what images do I have. You can see that these are my images, and to to download this image, the, uh, the, the Zeppelin, we have to run this command. Hmm. Sorry. So now we have to wait a little uh, to, for, to, to download, to download uh, Zeppelin. The download is completed. Now we need to run the second command. And now we can access the, the Zeppelin using this, this URL. If you want to read more about Zeppelin, here is the, the official website. Basically, Zeppelin is a, is a, a notebook which uh, allows you to to write code in uh, in browser and uh, to share that code between uh, users so here is our uh, docker host let's find it the docker host is exposed here and the zeppelin zeppelin is listening on port 8080 so yeah, here is the Zeppelin already installed. We can create um, a new a new notebook. Let's name it Test Spark. Let's load the Spark context. You see that it's running. Come on. Yes, we have the Spark context already initialized. And to try only a little example of Spark, let's create an RDD using the parallelize method. Let's run it. We have that RDD and uh, let's run an action on that RDD, this data. Count 
see how many elements does the RDD ha has so yes that's correct so basically you from here you can uh, start to learn spark and to apply um, you know, examples you can you can start uh, with example from from uh, the official website of uh, of spark here you can see a lot of examples so yes we have all the necessary tools to to learn to learn spark so yes good luck